why does long-term care insurance seem to be missing in employer benefit packages and association packages? What we're going to talk about today is really some reasons and some benefits to the employer or the association to include it, and some benefits to you as a member or an employee as a way to actually get long-term care insurance. I mean, the first point that I want to make is, is I can't go anywhere without talking to people that aren't dealing with something of this in their own family. They're taking care of their parents, their uncles, their aunts, their siblings, they're the caregivers for these people. Um, when you look at statistics of why people miss work, why people take leaves of absences, if you look into the EAP programs uh, inside employment where people need counseling and they need help for this, this is a real problem today and I don't really have, I'm not informing of employers of anything they don't already know is people miss a lot of work over caregiving issues and it really just kind of leaves them wondering who's going to take care of me? What's this going to do to my retirement? What resources do I have available so that I'm taken care of when I'm in that situation? Um, the current benefit programs that are offered 401k and pension, group health insurance, disability, life insurance. I mean, first of all, all these things are for your retirement and for your financial situation. And they generally, they offer little or no coverage for extended care or for long-term care. I mean, this is something that really for middle class and upper middle class, for folks of a bit of means that are employed, uh, this is something you just got to pay out of pocket if you don't have it properly insured. And a long-term care crisis in retirement or at retirement or in late retirement disrupts what all of this, the good that this was meant to create. Is if, if you've got a bunch of money saved up for retirement to supplement your Social Security and then all of a sudden you've got to throw that at long-term care expenses. Those are some, this is some real reasons to, to put this in the offerings and to get employees to seriously consider it. Now, there's three benefits that you just can't get on your own when you're buying long-term care insurance. Um, first of all, the simplified health question. So if we get enough people together in a group, we can get simplified or easy underwriting. And that means that some people that couldn't buy long-term care coverage on their own that are your employees or your association members could actually get qualified for a plan um, through the benefits of the group. Secondly, there's discounted premiums that are available, so they're going to reduce the premium, taking into account the collective nature where we're able to offer this to a large number of people at once. And then uh, the third benefit is really access to a, a professional planner, a personalized planner, somebody who can, we have a team of CFPs here at Cardinal who, who really specialize in elder care and long-term care and people that are actually in retirement and late retirement, we're able to offer these type of programs and really go right down to offering it individually to each member of the group that wants to consider it. Then there are tax benefits to offering this. I mean, first of all, for your organization, either your association or specifically in an employment situation, if you choose to pay for part of the premiums, which you don't have to do, you can simply just offer it uh, if you do pay for part or all of the premium, you're going to get a tax deduction. Um, employees or the members, if they pay their, on, their own premiums, they're going to get a tax deduction. Uh, Long-term care benefits come to the people tax-free. So in retirement, when you're in this retirement, you're not having to tap your 401k or your other savings. And then the benefits that you do get come tax-free. Um, you can discriminate, or we, and when we're recommending executive compensation plans, we can discriminate and put a plan just for a class of employees or in an executive compensation plan, and we can write the premium off. Um, and then there's a life insurance benefit on some plans that comes tax-free to the beneficiaries. So there's lots of tax benefits in doing this type of planning. Um, and then really the fifth reason is the employee and member goodwill. I mean, your employees and your association members, this has been missing. They've, they've kind of forgotten about it. And they're really going to appreciate when this offering comes out 
um, that, that you're looking after. And the policies on all of these plans that we offer are portable. They're guaranteed renewable for life that people can take it with them. So uh, I want to thank you today. I'm Hans Scheil, and uh, our business is in Durham, North Carolina. We're licensed in 50 states in the District of Columbia, so we can work with folks all over the United States. There's my phone number. Uh, there's our website, and I thank you very much for listening.